What's up today my fellow Madden soldiers? So what I'm going to be doing right now is showing you guys how you could get over 100,000 XP within 30 minutes. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So I know you guys are looking up above and you guys are seeing that I'm level 2, only 2200 coins, right? And you're like, how are you going to show me how to get 100,000 XP in 30 minutes and you're only level 2? Here's the thing, this is a whole nother account, just so I could clarify that real quick. On my main account, I am level 35 and on my no money spent team which i just barely started the first day within the 30 minutes right i got over a hundred thousand xp plus more because i'm already level 17 in one day on my no money spent team account just so you guys know that even though I, I'm, I'm working on the the videos and i'm doing videos as i continue to level up just to show you guys the progress and now that i'm speaking about the no money spent team if you guys are interested in that no money spent team it will be uh, posted, it will be pinned to the comment section, um, my my second channel where I'm going to be posting all my no money, spent team con uh, no money spent team content because on this channel, it seems that a lot of people are more interested in other things. So I made a channel specifically just for that. So if you guys want to see it, my second channel will be pinned to the comments, uh, comment section. Just subscribe to that channel and you'll get notified every time I upload a video. But anyways, as I was doing that no money spent team, I realized, hold on here. You can actually level up fast for those doing the no money spent, for those who just open up their squad, for those who want to go and check out certain objectives and get more XP to help you level up a little faster. This is going to help all you guys, right? So that's what got me thinking that I need to do this video just to let you guys know on how to do that. So now let's go ahead and uh, make it happen. So what you're going to want to do is go to the view all field passes. Right. I'm going to make it as easy as I can for you because I know it's a little bit complicated. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best. Stay with me because I'm gonna tell you guys right now. I'm gonna show you something, and then I'm gonna show you the easiest way to get it. So you're gonna go to season one. All right, you're gonna go to programs. You're gonna go to headliners. Right, headliners is one of the ones that you get the most XP from, from leveling up with the headliners as well as when you're leveling up with the headliners, you're getting XP. So read right here. Where our goal is to get to level seven, reach level two of headliners field pass get 12,000 xp reach level four of headliners field pass get 20,000 season xp right reach level five of headliners field pass get 25,000 xp reach level seven of headliners field pass get 28k xp so those four together once you hit uh, re, uh, reach uh, two to seven that all automatically is going to equal 85,000 XP. So just by completing those objectives, you're getting 85,000 XP. And then you guys thinking like, okay, well, how am I going to get it that fast? Well, I have a method to show you guys how you're going to get it that fast. So stay with me, right? Some of this stuff is going to cost coins. Like I said, I'm not going to sit here and say some of it's not going to cost coins. Some of it is. So keep that in mind. But, but, all right, just these headlines XP could get 85,000 XP for very cheap. But there's uh, another another set that I'm going to show you guys right now that's going to actually get you XP also. So these right here, you're already going to know it's going to get you about 85,000 XP. So keep that in mind. All right. Then you're going to want to go to uh, Team Affinity. And when you go to Team Affinity, go all the way down here, complete two sets, two Team Affinity sets, right? So you could, you could uh, complete two Affinity sets, you're going to get 15,000 XP. So the 85 plus the 15 is going to get you 100,000 XP. So keep that in mind, right? You still got to complete the objectives of the headlines, which I'm going to show you right now. But get this done first. Get this done first right here. Uh, complete two affinity sets. And you're going to get 50, uh, 15,000 XP, right? Now let's back out. Now what you're going to want to do is go straight to the headliners, um, headliners objectives. Then what you're going to want to do is go to the headliners program. Then you're going to want to go all the way down a set. Complete, uh, complete five headliner set. Complete one headliner, uh, headliners hero set. I'm getting a little bit tongue twisted. So then you're gonna want to do this next. Get this out the way. You're gonna get 3,500 XP of the headliners XP. You need 10,000 headliners XP in order to get the 85,000 season XP. So keep that in mind. You need 10,000 headliners XP to get 85,000 season XP. So these two alone right here are already going to get you 3,500 headliners XP in order to get the other, was it like, what, 7,500? 75 plus 35, is it 35? Is that what it is? No, 6,500. Okay, this is what you're going to do. 
Then what you're gonna wanna do, okay, is go to, oh, solo battles, okay. Okay, so what you're gonna wanna do is go, okay, let me let me show you this real quick. Let's go to, uh, go right here. Go right here, I'm going somewhere, so still stay with me. It says complete 10 passes in a single game, you get a thousand XP, all right? You, you could complete all this, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to a solo battle. And if you guys, you guys look at, you guys could go and play it on Legend if you want to. You're gonna have a, a problem doing that, right? You're gonna have a big problem doing that. Let me tell you guys that right now. And the reason why is because it's very complicated to win. Look, if you want to play all your games on, on Legend, go ahead and do it. But I would encourage you guys to play it on Veteran, right? At least to get the, as much as you can out of the Soul Battles. And it's gonna be, it's gonna be arcade, and you're gonna, you're gonna complete this insanely fast. Just come, just do one game like this. Just do one game. So in that one game, you're gonna you're gonna uh, complete ten passes in a single game, force just force five fumbles. All that right there is already fifteen hundred season XP. Don't worry about the fifteen hundred rushing yard because that'll take a long time. Then you're gonna be able to. So these two are gonna come together. So basically in house, I mean uh, uh, in the solo battles, you're gonna you're gonna create twenty fumbles. Very easy, right? Because you're gonna be in that game for about 10 minutes, right? Because you're gonna be knocking, every time you kick it off to them, you're gonna be knocking them out. Every time they run it, you're gonna be knocking it out. I'm telling you right now, in one solo battle, I got more than 20 fumbles. They're so easy on veteran, because it was arcade. I just play, please play one game like that. All right, so I already told you about these right here. And then what you're gonna wanna do as you're playing the solo battles on top of that, all these you could complete in one game. You're gonna wanna, okay, let's go right here. Get a sack with headliner players in your lineup because you're because you already completed those sets. You're gonna have headliner players. So where's the where's the five touchdowns? There should be a five touch here. Score five touchdowns. Attempt two point conversions. All right. You want to do? That's all you're gonna have to do. All right. Go to solo battles. Put it on veteran so it'll be arcade. You're gonna get your two point conversion. Complete your five touchdowns. You could get a sack with your headliner player in your lineup. You don't even need to do that. That's just gonna be extra, right? You just need to do the win a five, uh, uh, five, uh, five games with headliner players in your, in your on your team, and you're gonna be able to do that because you complete those sets. So you're gonna have those into your set, all right? Then you're gonna attempt two point conversion. You don't even have to make the two point conversion. You just attempt it and solo battles, which is very easy. Then you score five touchdowns. You're gonna score way more touchdowns than that. So you're already gonna have all that, right? So just doing all that alone, and you could continue on and do this right here to level up even faster. I would complete attempt five, two, uh, eight two-point conversions in solo battles. Do it on RK. Do every two-point conversion you possibly can and make it happen because I'm telling you guys right now, it's going to be the easiest thing. Just do one of them in veteran RK and you'll complete all these objectives. And once you complete all those objectives that I showed you right now in the Headliners program, just those small ones, just by playing one game, you're going to get 10,000 XP of the headliners program which is going to give you 85,000 season xp so keep that in mind go to a solo battle arcade mode right just at least one complete all those objectives in one solo battle right because because some of these you're going to have to complete in solo battles like right here attempt four times two point conversions in solo battles right so some of these you're going to have to complete in solo battles solo battles so that's why i'm trying to encourage you guys just to go to solo battles period and complete all those objectives in one game and get it out the way so you got to worry about that worry about that again and just play on legend if you want to do that right you want to make it easy as possible as you can um at least with one game to complete all these objectives like i said you do all this that i showed you right here you're going to get ten thousand headliners xp and that 10,000 headliners XP is going to give you 85,000 season XP, right? You complete those one sets, the team affinity sets, just those two, it's going to give you 15,000 season XP. So those two together is going to give you 100,000 XP, right? I hope that I simplified it as much as I possibly can for you. Um, I just wanted to break that down because doing those certain things, like I said, it, it, made me, it made it easier for me to understand and get it faster. And look, I know you guys tell me, well, it's going to cost me um a little bit of coins in order to complete those sets yeah it will just complete those sets use those players in your game so you can complete the objectives once you're done just sell them they, they're going for quite a bit of coins just sell the players back you ain't even got to worry about it you gotta you ain't gotta put them in other sets or anything like that they're gonna they're gonna come back to you not now they're gonna come back to you auctionable so once you're done using those players to complete the objectives sell them back and you'll get your coin back you might take like a small loss but that's nothing in compared to all the XP you're going to get. And mind you, it's around the corner that this is all going to be over with when it comes to 
um, these certain uh, program objectives. So keep that in mind. But anyways, there it is there. If you guys like seeing what you seen, drop a like on the video. If you guys need subs to the channel, there will be more great, amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm out.